Yo, this is a calm gamer. In a speed run, seconds matter. I think of the strategies that help you get better, faster, and more efficient at gaming. Today, I'm focusing on identifying the fastest car in State of Decay 2. My hope is that you enter the Hall of Fame and remember that I, calm gamer, played a small part in helping you to get there. But before we start, remember to like, subscribe, and comment. I do reply often. Now look, uh, I'm going to mispronounce some things, and Jimmy Crackhorn, get over it. Let's get into the analysis. For a speed run, you can't settle on a mediocre vehicle. You need speed. And right now we're comparing the Impaler, to the Viking, to the Legender, to the Road Racer MX. Now the Viking is the only truck vehicle that we decided to test. We believe it was the fastest, or at least the most worthwhile to look at. The Road Racer MX seems to have taken an early lead, followed by the Impaler, and then the Legend. All of these cars are good choices for different reasons. But when you're looking at a speed run, and the most important thing that you're looking for here is speed. I, despite the fact that some of these vehicles m might get caught up on maybe small rocks or uh, or a sidewalk, you need to take that in as a risk. Given the Hall of Fame, your only goal is really to do it fast. Alright, these guys are coming in. Get ready for the time measurements. Okay, moving along here, we've got the Road Mangler on the top left, with the Helion on the top right, the Mega Max on the bottom right, and yes, uh, the repeated Road Racer MX on the bottom left. It's repeated because, I mean, look, it's the fastest of this four set, so we might as well keep it in here to compare against these three. Now the Road Mangler vehicle is actually just a vehicle kit applied to the Road Racer MX. The Helion and the Mega Max are both upgraded vehicles as well. And you're, I know that you're going to have one more question here. You're going to be like, hey, do I need an extra gas can in my, in my inventory in order to actually complete the speed run? And I'm going to tell you something very, very simple. No, you do not need another gas can. What you need to do is make sure that you know how to get around and to focus on your paths so this way you can go in the shortest way possible and not have to use a second can. Alright these guys are coming in. We got the Mega Max at a minute and nine seconds. But honestly any one of these vehicles are an excellent choice. In fact here's my top four. Now get one of these vehicles and go out there and win me in a Hall of Fame trophy. Go. This is Calm Gamer, signing out.